All right, now what we're going to talk about is my first arrival to South Korea, Seoul. Right here is the Han River, and uh, we were, I was chasing the sun for about 15 hours on the uh, Korean air. Very nice. Um, you can see the reflection off the uh, off the water slash land. And when I arrived, I had to take a bus from the airport. And, um, you take bus number 6103 to the city air terminal. Notice they misspelled terminal, but that's probably how they say it. And the first things I noticed was that everyone drives on the right side of the road. You know, they're trying to build some small greenhouses and small like farmland. Over in the distance right here, you see like the mountain with the Seoul Tower. Here I would like to introduce the first friends in Korea. They were also my roommates for a week. They work at Changdum. So I have a friend who is a ginger, like bright orange hair, curly as all can be and shit. Goes over to Beijing to teach English in the north for like a year. Uh, Beijing is in the northern part of China because it's huge. Um, and then it's like halfway through his hair just turned black. He thought it was just all pollution and everything, right? So he tries to get it off. But it's not changing his hair color. And even after he left Beijing, came back to the U.S. for the last few years, his hair has stayed black the entire time. Like, oh, it is not going back to orange at all. His entire family is just orange. It's just like, jeez, man, I am not going to Beijing. And then he's like, I have a fr friend over who's in Beijing, somebody said earlier. And I was like, dude, good luck with that. Like, when China said, you can come over and teach English, I, I was like, yeah. Then after I saw my friend do it, I was like, to hell with that. Oh, like, because they're like shooting water in the air just to reduce that shit, you know? Water, buying cans of air, People you wear know? masks here. <laughs> I know, shit that comes it's coming China. over. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> that. Did you support it? And then what did you say? Yeah, all right. I said, the Asian just rubbed off on him. <laughs> oh, right. That's right, the Asian, yeah. <laughs> she was like, she did. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then this is a walk through what Gangnam looks like. Lots of people lined up to get on the buses. Sometimes they, even at night, you know, like even 10 p.m., you see like people just a line backed up all across, you know, along the buildings. And uh, this was my first um, impression of Seoul, being in Gangnam. And I highly advise, um, you know, that if you want to see it as a good experience, um, not necessarily nightlife, but just uh, to see like a lot of attractive people and a lot of interesting people, Gangnam would be the place to start your first uh, first week. Um, of course, everyone's always busy, but you see like model type girls and stuff like that walking across uh, along the roads all the time. I saw that here more often than. Um, anywhere else so far and um, the first time that I was here you know I I had to learn the subway stations and how they worked you know I thought at first that to go in the subway you just go down underground and there's a subway but it's not there's like there can be up to 12 exits especially when there's like a big shopping center underground you can get easily lost and uh, I have to say advice that to be familiarized with the subway to uh, explore by yourself. I was gonna say, man, I mean, you could have used my 350. <laughs> I mean, it weighs more than it looks, you know. I said, let's start the launch, please wait. I'm not sure that shit. Damn. We are here. So, did you buy a card or did you just buy like no. one entry? No, one entry. Oh. So. Any idea where we are on there? Yeah, we're at Gangnam. That circle. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, so then we're, we're going to Green Line, yeah. No, no, no. Wait, are we on the orange line? No. No, we're at Green now. Okay, we're on Green. We I could be at Red, who knows? But we'll go Green for sure. Go Green. And then we're going to take it three lines to the right. So immediately when we woke up for the first day in Gangnam, we wanted to explore the city and familiar, familiarize ourselves with the subways. 
So we were going towards the Coex Mall, and while we were on the subway, we found this uh, Korean man. Uh, we actually encountered him a few times. Here we are at the Coex Mall. With his help and some guidance from him, we found the Coex Mall and some other spots that we could also explore. Oh my god, it's bright! I wonder why everyone is waiting. Looking at the sun. You know what you need? Yeah, I got it. It's a All right, let's check the McDonald's and see yeah. if we got the crab burger. <laughs> yeah, let's look for another crab, uh, crab burger. No, no, not crab burger. They really should have a crab burger. That'd be awesome. I swear I heard somewhere that they have crab burger. Yeah, there's crab burger. Imagine going through, like, drive through and just entering all that stuff. Oh, it's on breakfast now. So they don't have Oh, well, we can still ask later. Cool, Where's the to-go button? No, no, the delivery button for tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know. I In the Coex Mall, their directory is an interactive touch screen. Why wouldn't it be this way? the fast. And it gives you routes and ETA time. But I think we're already slightly closer to that sign. Oops, I messed it up. Go Wait, ahead. Keep finding shop again. Dude, that's awesome. But he's gonna he's gonna put it on the same. So just look over here. Search route. Okay. Four minutes five seconds. Wait, that's a five minute walk. <laughs> I was thinking it was just like right around the corner. Right around the corner. Here I zoom into okay, the so Diaso store. D. A I S O. That's like the dollar store. Um, everything's cheaper. You can buy everything. It's a pretty cool store. Okay, so how are you guys liking your food? I um, it's too hot to touch, man. Pretty spacey so far. Really What'd sizzling. you order? The bulgogi hut. Or something. I got some spicy chicken. Yeah, like it's sizzling on the side. It's hard harder to get off on the side. And so this one is uh, maybe octopus. Maybe octopus. Maybe octopus. octopus. You gonna try some? Oh, congratulations on getting that. That's pretty adventurous. On the first day, man. Yeah, first day, baby octopus. I mean, Go ahead, try it out. Let me see one of you take a bite. You got it. It's all you. I mean, right. yeah, the first bite's yeah, gotta be Go you. for it. So. Oh gosh. Okay. It's definitely not hot. It's not spicy? Not like hot. So after we were eating our first Korean meal in the Kovex Mall, uh, we found this bakery and it has some interesting cakes that I've never seen in the US. Here's <laughs> TJ taking a picture of his ice cream cone. Oh, I should have taken a picture of the food. I'm an idiot. Mm. There's a lot of activity going on outside of the Coex Mall around the remote area. And so there was this World Trade Center of Seoul. And so here's a picture of um, the World Trade Center of Seoul. Each of those pillars have like a different country's flag. Right there you see the space shuttle. This is a uh, panoramic from the bottom up and the top looks like a Batman. And this is us trying to climb it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I would die. Like three more steps up? No, you won't die. Three more steps. What is three more steps, right? <laughs> this is your stairway to heaven. You can't mess this up. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> My turn. That was awesome. Just across the Kovex Mall, we found a, a ceremony. It's a Buddhist ceremony. And we start from the bottom of the hill and just walk up steps all the way up to the top where nature is. So we're gonna follow TJ up the path.
각각 잊지 말고 받아가시기 바랍니다. 아 그리고 제가 공지사항에도 말씀을 드렸는데요. It's like a hiking trail over there. <laughs> so funny how we were at a Buddhist temple. Now we're in the middle of nature. And just a minute, an hour ago, we were at the mall. So what I just did is I took a picture of a guy taking picture of a girl doing the Gangnam Style dance underneath a giant statue of some hands that says Gangnam Style on it in the Gangnam District in Gangnam, South Korea in Seoul. <laughs> 